Bitcoin digital currencies and blockchain technology. All the buzz right now among old and new investors alike. But what purpose does this new craze serve to consumers and businesses? Why should this be on your radar as an entrepreneur? And where do you even begin? When you look at getting into cryptocurrency, because it's a very, uh, you know, it's, it's a very big endeavor to take on. And what we looked at was how do we make sure that people can make money and have the least amount of money being taken out of the paycheck. CEO and founder of Moonlighting, Jeff Tenery, says his company, which pairs business owners with freelancers, has found multiple ways cryptocurrency can benefit his business and their customers. When you think about, you know, people get hit with taxes and such, and when you look at a lot of these gig economy marketplaces, they take as much as 20 or 30 percent of the payment away from you for being in that marketplace. And so with cryptocurrency, as a great opportunity for people to make and keep, you know, retain 100% of what they're earning uh, before taxes. But also, as we look to expand internationally, we're looking to go to Latin America, United Kingdom, to Canada. We lo wanted to remove a lot of the pain associated when you're dealing with different countries and the exchange rates. So, Tenery moved his company to blockchain technology. And so that's really, the, I think, the more important buzzword for 2018 is talking about blockchain technology. That's why you're seeing countries, banks, all sorts of institutions moving to it. And what blockchain does, it, it creates a level of trust. This was really the second reason why, really the first reason why we made the decision to take our platform and, and create more of a blockchain-based technology around it, and which is why I think you're seeing it explode um, as a big part of companies using the ICO as a way to leverage blockchain technology. A new path for wealth and opportunities. And businesses like Moonlighting are now seeking legal advice from blockchain lawyers across the globe to help them hit the ground running. I always caution people to uh, not invest in something that they don't understand. So I would say step one is obviously don't invest more than what you can afford to lose. Sharon Yen is a digital currency and blockchain technology attorney who says more and more companies are looking to understand the market and even issue their own coins. So a lot of companies are issuing tokens on the Ethereum network. They're called ERC-20 tokens. Mm -hmm. um, and those tokens actually serve a particular function within the app that they're creating. We have grown very quickly and rapidly over the three years and, and uh, are addressing what I think is the most important uh, part of, of today's economy is creating um, some sort of diversity in the way that you earn a living so you're not always relying on a W-2. It's a huge new world and it's going head to head with old world finance systems and government regulators. You can see my complete interviews with Jeff Tenery and Sharon Yen just by clicking on these links you see right here or in the description below. I'm Scarlett Fakar. Thanks for watching Real Investment News.